Hey guys, Geno Zero. How you doing? Hope all is well. Uh, me and my good buddy, Mr. Moving On Greg and Mrs. Moving On 04. Good, good friends of mine. We're out here. We are working on the what is going to be the new and improved outdoor kitchen here. Uh, you guys remember we had the brick uh, cook pit and the little uh, wood pile and stuff like that here. But we're gonna what we're what we've done is we got a form here. And we are going to make it nine bricks long, which is, I don't know how many feet that is, by two foot wide. And then the first thing we're going to do is we're going to pour concrete down, uh, make a concrete slab. We're just using bags of quick crete uh, to make it all level with the bricks. And it will make it at a little angle so they can drain and all that kind of stuff. But that way we'll have, you know, the wood pile at the end that uh, has a place to get it up out of the dirt, off the ground, so it'll stay drier. And then we'll have our cook pit here in the middle. And then uh, the little pit for the uh, the rocket stoves and the hunter stoves so we can put the oven on top of it and all that good stuff is going to be right through here. So the first step uh, is done, which is to uh, build up a form for so we can get our bags of quick crete and the wheelbarrow and start making concrete and uh, putting it up there to make the base. So we're going to get after it. It's a beautiful day. So we will back with you here in a little bit once we get to the next step. Okay guys, you can see we're just using quick creek. Yeah. Mix it in a wheelbarrow. That's fine, dump it right there. Dump it out. Oh yeah. Filling in our form. Yeah, yeah. A little yeah, bit wet. Gonna and I'm quite sure there's gonna be some awesome construction dude out there gonna be like, you're doing it wrong. Swamp rat man. <laughs> you're doing it wrong. But we're working with what we got. Yeah. And we're just going to fill in. We're filling in the yep. blocks here. You can see how we filled it in. Over here, we got everybody's name written in the uh, concrete and the year. So, uh, this is what we're doing. Oh, and we almost had Mr. Moving on falling off the wall yeah, there. He almost, he almost pulled a J all there. Three times. So, once we get this all said and done, then we'll get back with you and show you what it looks like when we're uh, done with this particular part. You know, it's not real high. Okay guys, you see we got our whole slab here, uh, as far as we want to go with it. I think we used like, I don't know, 11 or 12 bags of uh, quick crete. We got a couple of them left to do the bricks with. Yeah, I know it's not mortar, it's concrete, but we're doing working with what we got, so don't give me no crap about it. There's, uh, we've got this uh, first layer of bricks in. We got them standing on their side so that the air can get in. This is, we're gonna, this is gonna be our grill area, the grill pit. That way the air can come in and uh, fuel the fire. We just uh, did our measurements like that by setting the uh, the grill uh, grate, I guess you call them, right there. That's going to be uh, it'll be another couple of it'll be another brick higher. It's not going to be that close, but uh, this we just put these out right here. That way, the wet concrete we went ahead and got everything in and uh, starting to get it all drawn out and figured out. We got it level, so that is going to be the the cook pit right there that's where we're going to be that way we have the other grate that goes over on this side and then we'll have our fire in the middle that's cooking everything with but while the concrete is still uh still moist and damp we're putting these bricks in and uh like i say we're working with what we got here so this is the uh this is where we're at so far down here on this end is where we're going to build the uh, little kind of enclosure to put the oven on with the rocket stove and we're going to build another enclosure down here with brick to put the hunter stove that way we'll have the whole grill line where we can have the wood over here the grill right here and then the two stove tops over here to cook on so it's going to be awesome so uh that's going to be once we get this other stuff over here laid out and then uh, we'll catch back up with you okay guys just to kind of give you an idea of what the uh, finish thing is going to look like you know, we're going to naturally we're going to finish building this up with the bricks and uh, we'll put the cooking grates on and then we'll fill this up in here with brick uh, for the oven area so we can slide the stove in and out We'll have a little area here for the hunter stove. We may we haven't decided yet whether or not we're going to brick it in. And we'll have a regular area for utensils and ingredients and little stacks of stick wood uh, to use for the stoves. Uh, that way we're not nothing laying in the dirt. But we're going to end this video here. This is where we are. We're getting to the end of the day. Uh, hopefully this uh, tomorrow we'll start finishing up the bricking uh, and finish it all out. And the next time you see this, it should be uh, done. And, and the next time we uh, we're going to break it in this weekend cooking. And we'll let you uh, let y'all see the finished product. But like I say, for now, uh, we're just getting the brick, everything laid out to where we want it. Give ourselves room to slide the stove in and out. We give ourselves room to put the oven on, and we give ourselves room to put the canner on top of it and stuff like that. And uh, just a kind of a work in process. 
work in progress as we go. So, like I say, for it, that, that's it for now. Uh, we'll uh, get back with you when we get a little bit more done. But it's almost supper time, and I'm hungry. <laughs> Thank you, my, my good friend, Mr. Moving On Greg, for the help. Appreciate it. Welcome. <laughs> Anytime. Y'all have a great evening. Uh, God bless. Yeah. Buzz, buzz, the end.